video we shall be learning years purchase and we say the years purchase is the present value of amount of one euro per annum it gives the immediate value of a single sum to be received after a stated number of years the years purchase is of two types we have the yp single rate and we have the yp dual rate the YP single rate is an accumulative rate, while the YP dual rate is accumulative and remunerative rate. The formula for YP single rate is 1 minus PV over I, while the formula for YP dual rate is I 1 all over I plus s where s is the sinking fund all right if you don't know what sinking fund is please just watch our previous previous videos we've made justice to what sinking fund is all right so in this video again we shall be talking about yp single rate this in question yp single rate now, YP single rate is the landlord's rate. YP single rate is the landlord's rate. It's not the tenant's rate is YP dual rate. In our in some videos ahead, we shall be differentiating between YP single rate and YP dual rate. So if you are new to this channel, please like, share, subscribe, comment so that we'll be able to have you more so in this question now this is an example they say the landlord will receive 100 naira per annum for rent and the hundred thousand naira for rent from his tenants for the next 20 years all right assuming what eight percent compound interest rates what is the capital value of the income you know we said um, annual payments when you multiply um, your given number of years at a given rate one can use it to multiply a net annual payment to obtain a lump sum called the capital value All right so here we're trying to obtain the capital value and the annual payment is hundred thousand there so now the landlord you know now we calculate using the yp single rate check it out the landlord will receive hundred thousand naira per annum for rent from his tenants for the next 20 years assuming eight percent company interest rate what is the capital value of the capital value of the income so let us expand this our uh, formula it says 1 minus PV is 1 over A all over I which is now equals to 1 minus 1 all over 1 plus I raised to power N all over I alright and in our question here our analysis firstly you say the amount is how much is 100,000 Naira Yes, is how many years? 20 years. Then the interest is 8%, which is equal to 0 0.088%. Alright, so let's impute these figures to our formulas. Now equals to 1 minus 1 all over 1 plus 0 0.08. Close your bracket, raise the power. N, our n is what 20 all over i which is 0 0.08 now it's equals to 1 minus 1 all over 1.08 plus your bracket is about 20 all over 0 0.08 which is our i right which is now equals to 1 minus 1 all over 1.08 1.08 raised to the power 
twenty is four point six six one zero four decimal places all over zero point zero eight. Right. So the next thing we do is to divide write it again one minus right one divide by one divide by one divide by four point six six one zero is equals to zero point two one four five zero point two one four five all over zero point zero eight all right so now let's go ahead now one minus one minus zero point two one four five is equals to zero point seven eight five five all over zero point zero eight all right so when you divide them zero point seven eight five five divided by zero point zero eight what you get is nine point eight one eight eight four decimal places. All right, nine point eight one eight eight. Now you now multiply it with the sum, which is what hundred thousand. Now times okay nine point eight one eight times 100,000 which is equals to 90,81,808 it is the bid sum which will be accepted which you will receive the capital sum at the end of 20 years so thank you very much if you have any question about why be single rate please just drop it on the comment section right in our next video we shall be talking about yp dual rates so thank you